So we kick. Insane combo. Hi, how's it going everyone? So today we are playing a unique kind of meme deck. It's a very experimental deck. We are experimenting with different cards here. And one of the initial ideas was to experiment with crossbones and Punisher because I rarely touch these two cards which are like, like the mercenaries, right? Punisher, haven't touched this since pool 1 or pool 2. And crossbones, I only played this once with the quick storm deck. So I thought, you know, these two cards thematically seems pretty cool. Maybe it might work as well. Not too bad, not the worst kind of card, right? Decent power output. And then I decided to create like a junk lock kind of situation to really take advantage of these two cards, right? Mainly Punisher. So we are just dropping things like Debris, Add Rocks, Absorbing Man to also add Rocks as well. Green Goblin, then there's Mojo, and then there's Dr. Octopus to pull things down and Spider Woman to inflict minus one power. Stagron is an interesting choice. This is also another experimentation. I've gotten this card like since two weeks ago and I haven't even tried it. And you know, it's a quite an interesting one in the sense where you can control locations, you can move your opponent's card away. That means you can have some sort of power advantage, right? By kicking your opponent's strong or weak cards away. And in this case, it goes pretty well with Absorbing Man too. Absorbing Man's increase from three power to, to five power is, I would say it's sizable because now it is kind of a trend in this deck. Usually when I play this kind of junk rock deck, I lose quite often, but I can win about 30 to 40% now. Because Absorbing Man is way too insane. Because of Zabu, you have three cores Absorbing Man to copy a ton of things. You can copy Stagron, turn six, double Stagron to kick your opponent cut away, and you most likely guarantee a win in that location with 10 power from Stagron and Absorbing Man. It's, it's insane. And what about this? Spider Woman, turn 5, turn 6, Absorbing Man, you can absorb Spider Woman's power. So what this means is that you are casting this for 3 cores, and then you are minusing 4, I suppose, if you max out everything, right? Max out the location. So it's 3 for 9, which is pretty disgusting too. And then you have Stagron to knock things out of your way. You can combine it with Crossbones also, 3 for 8 with Zabu around. I think this deck has potential, and Absorbing Man really has a potential in a lot of decks. We just need to keep on experimenting. But right now, I think this is a decent win rate for a meme deck, but I think it can do better, and we can kind of fully utilize Stagon and Absorbing Man more, because when you, you play at the right time to get that win, nobody expects Stagon, and Absorbing Man with Spider Woman is insane, absolutely insane. Yeah, so I hope you guys enjoy the gameplay. Consider checking out the Patreon page and I will see you guys next time. Oh nice, we have Zabu. We can run our Stagron play. And if he's gonna fill this up, we can just Mojo. Yeah, that's nice. Uh I think for a start we, we can do Spider Ham. I'm not gonna play Stagron on turn 3 anyway. Oh, nice. Mm. He's gonna fill things up there, I might as well put Green Goblin over and give it to him. Yeah, I don't mind giving him the... We can just lock, lock him down prematurely, I think that's fine. Yeah, that's, that's good. He's gonna drop what? Kitty Pride, right? That's fine. It's not the end of the world. He still has an advantage, right? So you can just drop Spider Woman here. Or should we just Debris? I think that's fine. You can just Spider Woman. He's, he's probably gonna kitty pride that, that area. But he can't really do much to us anyway. At this range. Yeah, the choice is up to him whether he wants to fight. He wants to fight that, 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 right? So what we're gonna do is we are going to kick to kick him away. Eh, no. Wrong. Kick him away twice. Oh my god, this will be interesting. I want to see it happen. And at least we can kick it to 
to to the site to complete our our mojo, right? Oh my god, this will be interesting. Stagon absorbing man. Oh, oh my god. Please let me win. Please let me win. I think he's gonna drop Kitty Pride on Necrosha. That would be the only way to go. <sighs> he can play so many cards here, man. How many does he have in his hands? Fucks. He can play almost. He can play almost everything. Damn it. I don't think I can kick it, kick enough out of my place. Ten power, man. I think he know he confirmed lose white hot room. Ah oh, fuck! Why did he drop drop it there? Okay, okay. Thank God, that's fine. That's fine. That's the strong one, right? Okay, so we kick, and then we we kick again. One more, one more. Oh my god! Oh my god! Just oh my god! Oh my god! It's such an insane combo! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Okay, I think Zabu here will be pretty good. Uh, let's see, let's see. Ooh, fuck. Do we really not have anything to play here? That can't be the case, right? God damn it. I think we have two little cards already. We might need to switch also. Oh, our friend is not playing. Okay, guess that's fine. Um, I think he's probably gonna run something like a. Why is he? Okay. Interesting. I think what we can do is we can. Probably. Drop this, lock it down. And then we do this. This seems pretty alright. Most of the stuff we want here. <laughs> Too bad. Too bad. Uh I guess the good thing we can do here is. We can't really spill venom or whatever, we can just do crossbones here. And then we can do vibranium. I think the last thing we can do is spider woman. 8, eight power is pretty solid, ten, 10 power push is quite nice to have. I consider ending it with like staggon or something. Yeah. So I think we are pretty much good to go, right? So what we can do is we can do this here to get the guarantee to do this and this to get the guarantee too. This should be good enough. Yeah. Oh my god, we are just playing the same kind of deck. She's pretty funny. I wonder what he's gonna play. Oh, this is scary. Oh my god. Such an interesting game. Oh my god, so he was playing this deck. God damn it. God damn it. He was going to counter us. I, w I wasn't expecting the Titania going over there. A bit of a dumb, dumb move, but in the end we managed to seal the deal. Because if he didn't do that lock, right? He, he would have dropped Valkyrie. But even if he dropped Valkyrie, he would have tied himself. He wouldn't have won. Then that means we could have, we could have won the game using our hawk, right? Wow, Titan is difficult, man. But I love this. Mojo Punisher. This is the most, I would say, impossible combo in pool 3 late game. Early, uh, late rank. Oh, nice. If you have Stagon, you can potentially kick somebody. <laughs> that would be pretty nice. I mean, we have a pretty good play. Spider-Ham, Debris, Absorbing Man. 
Ah, uh, unfortunately, we can't do that because of Ethylon. Okay, we hit. That's good. I mean, it's not the best hit, but it's a good hit. I don't really mind that. After turn 3, okay, so we have to put Zabu here. No choice to put the center. So hopefully we draw our 4 cores. The good thing here is that we have great web, so we can eventually kind of like, I guess, um, we can fill the lanes up pretty easily. Okay. okay. So knowing this information, we probably the brief first, so that we can. Oh, nice. Oh, he hit himself. That's not too bad. I guess to end it off, we go with Spider Woman. And he has the advantage, right? So we get to spill our Venom last. So that's good. Ah, oh, fuck. Okay, that's good, that's good. We win that. We got a rock, that's fine. Uh. Oh my god, this is probably a good one here, right? If you do it this way. And he still has the advantage. God damn it. Wait, is this the best choice? Yeah. I don't mind. I think he might fill this out. I think there's a good chance. I believe he's gonna fill it up. Even if he doesn't fill it up, we can spill some venom and I think we are still pretty good. No, I think we might lose, man. Power wise, we definitely lose. We're pushing for 7, right? 7 plus 2, 9. Yes, 10 in total. No, plus 2, right? We still win. If he doesn't put anything there, we will win, right? Because we have 5, 5, 2, Absorbing Man Mojo, minus 2, 9, plus 2. Yup. That's the right play. Nice. We spill the Venom. Oh my god. One point. One point. One point. Victory. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is insane, man. The buff to him, 5 power with this. Essentially, this is 4 9 with little to no, no conditions. And if you have Zabu, it's 3 3 9. Okay. If you can get Zabu, that would be perfect. We really need our advantage here to drop our crossbones. Oh, interesting. We might lose, man. If you think about it. He's running Deadpool. They're gonna, they're gonna have a Killmonger. And our rocks are just gonna be fuel for his deck. Damn it. I think the first priority would definitely still be... Uh, spider Ham. Okay, that's not bad. Hopefully we hopefully we hit death. Ah, that's fine. Not the worst. And not the best. I want to play Absorbing Man, but I'm scared that he's playing the same thing again. He only has four cards. So we are hoping that the next card he drew was like Damn it. I think the right play here is to cross bones actually. Uh That's fine, that's fine. Um I guess what we do here is we dock orc here, considering he has this, and then we we try and pull down all of his destroy cards, right? Then we have a decent chance of ruining his strategy. And then we can pull down again. Yeah, that's good. Um, So what we do is we do... Are we able to pull down again?
Hmm. What is the right play here? I would definitely have to spew the Venom, right? Spew the Venom. Or can I just do a, do the minimum effort? No, I can't. Probably need to spew the Venom here. Nice. Okay, we have a decent chance here. We have a decent chance here. So he has to beat quite a fair bit, right? I think we just need to make sure we can clear this off. <laughs> oh my god, I really love this deck, god damn it. There's so many options here. Because, you know what happened? I can dog orc, and I can absorbing man dog orc again. I don't know, I don't know when that would be useful. But I can still, I can do it. I can do the double venom. I can do it too. I can do double ham. Oh, nice. Hopefully we hit something good. Uh, let's see, let's see. Come on. What is it? What is it? That's not bad. That's not bad. Okay, that's fine. That's a pretty good deal, I have to say. Um, okay. We'll play Punisher. Okay, this is nice. This is good for us. Because we can drop our Dr. Orc and we are pretty much good. I think we can stagger on this. Oh shit. That's fine. Maybe you can consider Dr. Octopus or something. Yeah. Turn 5, how would that be like? We can obviously kick one of them away. But there, there's no reason why we should do that. Um, I think we pause first, we don't play anything. Yeah, that seems about alright. I guess what we do is we do a... We do a dog orc here. To really kind of... There's a good chance we might lose because he will have something huge, right? Okay, that's fine. We can do a double, double spider woman situation here. Yeah. Let's just play this here. Nice. That's not bad. Uh. I think for the last card, we can probably kick the person away, right? Oh my god, I really love Stagron, man. I love this new playstyle, honestly speaking. It's like there's so much so much things to do. I can do Spider-Woman double, double woman, right? Double Venom. Or I can do a Stagron thing. I can kick people twice. Ah, uh, that sucks. Okay, let's see. Don't really have much options here. I mean, Enchantress is going to save us. Oh, wait. Was he going to run that deck? The Shuri crazy deck. I think what we can do is we can do Dog Orc. Oh, I really need something down. Okay. This is tough, man. Oh. Okay, that's not too bad. <laughs> Probably drop this here first. We can just win on Sanctum Sanctorum, I think. That's my approach. Oh my god, we have Jeff too. This is pretty insane, actually. Hey, wait, should I just play two cards instead? Nah, it's fine. Yep, then this gets hit to the left. And I'm pretty good. 16 power, is that sufficient? Do 
5 plus 3, 8. This is still the strongest though. 11 is still the strongest. Let's just give it a go. Hopefully this works. Ah, fuck. Oh my god. He won with Agatha, what the fuck? What the fuck? Agatha was controlling it all this time? Oh my god. I, I, I gladly lose to Agatha, man.